Hello everyone, today is April 2nd, 2014. I want to talk to you guys for just a quick minute about how to hand pollinate tomatoes. These are some big beef tomato clones that I overwintered. And today, being that it's April 2nd, it's really amazing for me to already have fruit on these plants. But I've been hand pollinating them. And there's one, there's another one in here, two, and three. So real quick, this is how you do it. You find a blossom, and let me get it to focus just right. You can see there's a green tip right at the end of it. And what you want to use is you want to use an artist style paintbrush, and you want to get some of the bristles to go in right where that green tip is. Not be easier if I had both hands. And you want to push the pollen up in because it has to travel backwards up the flower until it gets to the base down here where it fertilizes the female part of the flower. And this is where the tomato actually comes out and then the flower falls off. You hear people talk about slap your tomatoes because the wind can actually do it. So you see people coming out here and slapping them around, spanking them. But really it's the vibration of bees, their wings, that actually helps to loosen up the pollen and get it to travel backwards. Another trick that a lot of gardeners like to use is they like to use an electric toothbrush that vibrates and they come here and they vibrate along the back of this stem. They try to loosen up that pollen and get it to move backwards into the blossom. But I've been hand pollinating these and it works. So I thought I'd share that with y'all. If y'all enjoyed the video, please check out my other videos on Sabine River Authority. Thank you.